Hi everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Ultima Underworld. I'm Jay Paladin, and I think it's time we journey onward. You re-enter the abyss. So, here we are, right where we left off. Not that way. <laughs> um, I have... I'm not 100% certain we'll, we'll, where we'll be going next. Give me some light if I can. There we are. Now... Before we head off back into the water, let's check the map. See if we can get an idea of where we should head. Now, I think there might be a little bit of a path off to my right here. And there were branches, I think, here and here. I believe this is actually where I was attacked by Cthulhu. So, I'll head back, I'll check over here, and if that fails, head back this way and hit the branches as I find them. Curious how I'm holding a candle and keeping it a lot a lit while I'm swimming, but hmm. there we go. You see a drain. Can I pick that up? Cannot be activated. Okay. I wonder. No reaction. Okay. So, nothing over here. Excellent way to start off in the new video. Okay. So yeah, just tumbling through the water like this is so disorientating. Good sense of... I don't know. Not, not so much... Oh. I just want to grab a glitch. Just a good sense of not so much danger as discomfort. Alright, here's our first branch. And where does it go? To a slightly larger area. I think over there. Path over here. I have. I'm so curious if there's a way to fix that. Or if that's just an inherent flaw in the DOS operating system or what. Ooh, a lot of branches. Start on my left. But my uh, method for dungeon crawling is until I actually- Oh crap, with the loop! Run! Run from Cthulhu! Enemy has returned. I think. Or is that just me dripping water? Okay. Deal with this first. What is it? Crap, Cthulhu! No, not ass shit. Ah! Oh, crap! Now what happens? Oh no! <sighs> Crap. Okay, so loaded for my last save. Fascinating. Um, okay! I'm going to head back that way, and if this takes too long, I'll just... I might just skip to right there in the video. <laughs> well, I suppose that's a little dishonest. I mean, this is supposed to be a legitimate playthrough, so... If you get a little disorientated as to like where I'm going while I'm being buffeted around the water, don't feel bad, it's not just you. I have very little idea of where I'm going as well. Alright, click to this left wall. Experience level 2. I wonder what that means. I'm physically gaining experience just by swimming. Oh crap, Cthulhu. Turn him off, turn him off. Get out of the pool, get out of the pool. 
Oh, there you are! My arch enemy. Die! Die! Damn you, Batman! Why do you like these things? Shit, bone. BRB. Okay, so I'm back. I'm betting this one of you guys from the future, wasn't it? You call me just to throw off my recording. But, oh no, never start. Am I doing? Um, return to game. Now, where is my arch enemy? Well, for the moment it is quiet. I see a box. I see Cthulhu. Oh! X, X, X. Why is it so quiet? Did I screw with the sound levels? Why not? sound on my end. Oh well. Oh, there it is. pronounce those horribly. keeps changing and I don't know what it means. I mean, the battle theme is pretty easy to recognize, but... Banner of... The Banner of Caverus. 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 Huh. And a dungeon. Or, like... Like, a uh, Prison bars, or... You know what I mean. This thing. With something in it. See if he feels like talking. Drog! Yes? What's your business here? Um... Excuse me, I do not mean to intrude. This is best place to see when you see Abyss. King Vernix, he the bravest in whole underworld. You go see him if he see you. Okay. Um, 
Oh, hi. Just out of curiosity. A mellow goblin. Okay, so this guy's friendly. For anyone keeping track at home, that's two friendly NPCs. And actually, I'd like to know how many of enemies I've fought thus far. What's this? A bench. Cannot seem to use bench, so I'll move on. So I met Drog. Seems like a nice enough fellow. God, this is such a long hallway. Where's my sword? Mountain? So, I was just invited by a goblin to go see their king. If he'll, you know, allow me in his presence, that sort of thing. Um, that's pretty awesome. Just out of the blue, some random guy in a, with an awesome beard in his underwear just sort of rolls up to your front gate and says, Oh, I'm just kind of poking around. I don't mean to intrude. <laughs> and the card naturally says, Oh, yeah, sure, come on in. Talk to the king, he'd love to see you. Just a very, very friendly.